Hello students, in this video we will study one very interesting and magical thing about product of matrices. Here I have some calculations. First consider uh, this column of calculations. Here I have product of uh, two square matrices of order two and here I have their product matrix. Okay. Now what I do, I keep post multiplier matrix intact. I do not change this matrix. This post multiplier matrix I do not change it. I do not change it. I do not And I am transforming these two matrices simultaneously using some elementary operations. The first elementary operation is interchanging row 1 and row 2. I am keeping this matrix intact. I do not change it. And in these two matrices, I am interchanging row 1 and row 2. So, I have this result. Okay. Now, what is the magical thing? Here, multiplication minus 1, minus 8, minus 9, 1 plus 20, 21. Okay. Then 2 minus 6, minus 4, minus 2 plus 15, 13. Okay. So, here the product of these two matrices is equal to this matrix. Okay. Now, I am doing one more elementary uh, row transformation that is uh, I am multiplying uh, row 1 with 2. I am multiplying row 1 with 2 in this matrix simultaneously in this matrix. Okay. So, I have uh, here this new system. Now, again there is one magic. If I multiply these two matrices, what I get? Minus 2, minus 16, minus 18. 2 plus 40, 42, 2 minus 6, minus 4, minus 2, plus 15, 13. So, these row operations are usko karne se yahan pe jo equation hai, uh, wo valid hai. Thik hai na? Ye jo product hai, wo valid hai. Thik hai na? Jo change yahan pe kar rahe hain, wo hi change hain yahan pe kar rahe hain. Or surprisingly, in dono ka jo product hai, wo yahan ka changed matrix hai, na? Now, we have one more row transformation like uh, I am changing R2 by R2 minus 2 R1. I am multiplying elements of row 1 by 2 and then separating from row 2. So, I have here this new matrix on LHS and this matrix transforms to this one. This matrix is intact. Again, what will happen? The product of these two matrices will be this change matrix. Okay, we have here minus 2, minus 16, minus 18, 2 plus 40, 42, 6 plus 26, 32, minus 6, minus 65, minus 71. Okay, so here we have three elementary row transformation, interchange of rows, okay, multiplying any row with some constant and uh, doing this kind of operation like uh, r i changes to r i plus k times r j. After all these row transformation, we have product of uh, RHS matrices is equal to LHS matrix. Okay. On RHS, first matrix is transforming okay, and second matrix is intact. It does not change. Okay. Now, here we have row transformation. Now, we can do column transformation, but we do column transformation in post multiplier. Okay. So, here we have product of uh, these two matrices and this is their uh, product matrix. Okay. Now, what I do? I keep pre multiplier matrix intact. Jo pehla matrix hai, hum usko waise hi rakhenge. And we do column transformations in post multiplier matrix. Okay, we do column transformation simultaneously in post multiplier here and on LHS matrix. First transformation is interchanging column 1 and column 2. So, here we have this matrix, this matrix is intact. Okay, And here we have a matrix after interchanging column 1 and column 2. What we get? Minus 2 plus 15, 13, 2 minus 6 minus 4, 1 plus 9, 
वन प्लस ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी वन माइनस वन माइनस एट माइनस नाइन ओके सो हियर आफ्टर ट्रांसफॉर्मिंग दिस मैट्रिक्स यूजिंग कॉलम ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन प्रोडक्ट ऑफ दीज टू मैट्रिक्स इज इक्वल टू दिस न्यू ट्रांसफॉर्म मैट्रिक्स ऑन एल एच एस ठीक है ना नाउ वी डू वन मोर कॉलम ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन कॉलम टू चेंजेस टू टू टाइम्स कॉलम टू वी आर मल्टीप्लाइंग elements of column 2 by 2 so here we have on lhs this new matrix and on rhs we have this product in which first matrix is uh, same okay and this matrix transforms to c2 changes to 2c2 okay so we have here 2 minus 4 now product of these two matrices must be this and it is we have uh, minus 2 plus 15 13 4 minus 12 minus 8 1 plus 20, 21 minus 2 minus 16 minus 18. Similarly, if we do one more column transformation like this, C1 changes to C1 plus 3C2. In these two matrices, simultaneously uh, we have this new system. Okay, in this system also product of these two matrices is equal to this matrix, which we get after this transformation, after this operation. Okay, so what is the finding? If you want to do Row operation, row transformation, do it in pre-multiplier, and if you want to do column operations or column transformation, do it in the post-multiplier matrix. Okay. Now, what is the use of this? Now, using this, we can find inverse of matrix without using the definition of a inverse. That is. Uh, A inverse is equal to adjoint of A upon mod A. उसके बगैर हम मैट्रिक्स का इनवर्स निकाल सकते हैं 